Can we hear Michelle? Am I live? Because I don't know. Hello, hello, hello. Let me know if you're here, please. Pretty, please. I scheduled the live screen, um, live screen, live stream from the, um, from the computer. And I wasn't sure if it was going to, I don't know, connect with the phone, but I guess it did. Hey, couponing boy. So you guys can see and hear me, right? So we good. Are we good, good? Hello, hello, hello. It's been a minute. Couponing boy, it's you and Chantel. It's only been like a week and some days. That's it. Okay, hi Scott. It's only been a week and some days. All right, I'm pulling up the chat. Oh, over here. Today is Thursday. I know it's only been a week. I didn't do any videos or anything last week. Um, and then, then well, in a coupon world, Sunday starts uh, a new week for us. So I didn't do anything Sunday. And then Monday was Labor Day, which I was so hurt to discover that my kids didn't have school. Like, what? Y'all, I was like sitting at the table Sunday night and they were just working my nerves. They were loud. They were talking. Just all the above. And I'm like, y'all need to go to bed. It's 9, 10. Y'all should be in the bed already. What's going on? Y'all got school tomorrow. And everybody, all three of the kids and the hubby turned around all simultaneously and said, um, no, no, we don't have school tomorrow. Tomorrow Labor Day. And I'm like, what the hell? Since when? I was, y'all, I was hurt. Like, I was so disappointed. My entire mood changed. Because I'm sitting here thinking to myself, Monday, I'm going to get up, do what I got to do, get my stuff done around the house, get out and go coupon and live my best life. And then to find out that they didn't have school on Monday, I'm like, oh, my goodness. I, I try my best that when my kids are home, um, not to be out in the streets. Because we all know I can't go to one store well, I can go to one store, but Lord knows I'm going to spend about a couple hours in that one store because I'm going to do all the deals I can do, right? So anyways, whenever my kids are home, especially like out of school, I try my best to not be out in the couponing streets because otherwise I won't see my children. Anyways, um, hello, hello, everyone. Your English is terrible. Is it? I'm going to try to, I'm not going to even try to pronounce the first name. Vela, Vela Dears? No. Marcella. Am I saying that correctly? You say your English is terrible. My English is terrible. <laughs> and English is, is my first language. So don't feel bad. Hi, Jessica. I got my water going here. Hello, hello. Oh, thank you. She got that fresh dew. Thank you. Thank you. I want to know your beauty secrets for long hair. Girl, nothing. It is genetics. Seriously, genetics. I don't, um, and I mentioned this before, we don't put anything in our hair um, other than, like, I use grease, old school hair grease that, um, magic what is it blue magic or the dax old school grease and i really don't put it in my hair i just use it to condition my scalp and then i'll massage my scalp and that's really it the the secret i can tell anyone is that i don't wash my hair often like i literally probably wash my hair once a month and that's when i go to the hair salon to get a good wash um deep condition and get it flat iron or what have you but um yeah I think of dirt as protein, so it's good for your hair. But no, my hair doesn't stink. Don't, don't get me twisted. It don't stink. I ain't walking around here with all kind of stuff in my hair because I don't put a whole bunch of stuff in my hair. So, there you go. There you go. Thank y'all. Thank y'all. She cute, cute. She cute, cute. She hot, hot. I tell you that. Because I was outside uh, watering my babies before we went live, and she hot, hot. Okay, um, let's see. Yeah, last week was slow. This week is pretty slow, too. I mean, there were some decent deals this week, but it is slow. Uh, 
You see that I kept it up? That protects the ends too. Yes, yes, yes. With the Dax grease and the um, the blue magic. Old school stuff. There's no need to change. I remember when my, my girls were young. Not so much with Jada because Jada got a whole different type of texture of hair. Like, I don't know where her DNA come from, but her hair is just like, it's different. But me and Maddie, our hair is thick and coarse. Um, grease. I would just use, I would do, you know, when I had to wash their hair, I would wash their hair, uh, grease their scalp, put a little grease throughout their hair just to help kind of lock in some of the moisture. Um, comb it through, and then I'll plait up Maddie's hair, and then she'd be real, real cute with her little ponytails. Um, and what have you. But yeah, grease, old school grease. Uh, what deals did I do? We're going to get into that in just a second. Let me see. Hello, hello, hello. Yes, Jay. Yes, Jay. She got them inches. Yes, guys. Give the video a thumbs up, please. Everybody thumbs up the video. Okay, so we're going to do the weekly recap. And I'm going to go over some deals that I think that we should be doing this week to get ready for next week. Um, I have a new deal that I did today that I'm probably going to try my best to bleed out tomorrow a few more times um and then from there we'll just chat how about that how about that we'll do that and per usual if there's anything that i miss you guys have a question question um come back once the video is actually processed and leave it in the comment section that way i can answer you if i don't see it here now i'm no beautician but i found tea tree oil works um tea tree oil to work for hair growth you know tea tree oil lavender peppermint rosemary like the actual oil natural oil don't go buy all these different products that say they have these items in there the actual essential oil in its pure form is what i would use of course you have to use a carrier which you could use grease as a carrier or you can use like um jojoba is it jojoba oil hemp seed oil um, as a carrier for your essential oils that way it doesn't burn your scalp or what have you but what I would do and this is something I did with Jada because again she has a totally different grade of hair is I don't know where her DNA come from but she also has scalp psoriasis and it flares up really bad usually during the winter time and if she's not eating the best it flares up really really bad on her scalp thank goodness thank the Lord that we haven't had an issue with a in a couple years since I've changed up her diet and make her make sure she stays on top of her hair care routine. Anyways, all that to say is, I would put tea tree oil, a little bit of um, lavender or peppermint in a spray bottle with the um, the Jehovah oil or um, hemp seed oil, which I would warm that up. And I just spray it, like, on, or have her spray it on her scalp after she's done with, you know, dance, gym, or what have you. So that way all the sweat doesn't build up and cause her issues because of her psoriasis. Jay say almond oil and grapeseed oil is good too. And those oils, y'all, we can get those at the CVS and the Walgreens with our coupons. If they sell them, which they do. I know CVS does because I always get oil there. But Walgreens has essential oils too. So look there to save that money. Yes, Cassandra, you're out of detention. <laughs> You a mess, Cassandra. I took you out of the detention. You didn't see that I, I moved you from the detention spot. You're good now. You're good. Um, hi, Nicole. Hi, Shine. I haven't seen you in forever. Hi, Shine. Just tune in. And first thing I heard you say, bleed out tomorrow. What is this conversation about? <laughs> girl the deal a deal that i did today and i was like oh wait we got coupons for this this is a, a um a real good deal just to grab some register rewards for next week and i'll show that in a second okay so this week in my opinion there's not a ton going on we got some really good deals some decent deals but not a whole lot going on okay next week it looks pretty much the same looking at the ad for next week there's not a whole lot going on next week either in my personal opinion so Walgreens is kind of starting off the month of September real slow like let me pull, I'm pulling up the ad here see if I can get it up also um TMI because you know I feel like I should share all my business with you guys TMI so two things two things 
First thing, in the midst of getting all my sexy back, I'm trying to regain it all. I'm drinking more water. Now, if you guys ever have started like a water challenge where you're drinking more water, it really just drinking water instead of anything else, but drinking like at least a gallon or a half a gallon of water a week, then you know within that first week or two, your body be like, girl, wait, 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 wait. We don't have enough space to hold all the liquid you trying to put in there. So you literally be in the bathroom all day. So TMI, if I say, give me a second, if I say, give me a second, it's because I got to go potty, y'all. I'm not even lying. I've been going through stuff over here. Um, anyone know about PayPal promotion at CVS? Get $20 back using the app. I'm not sure about that. Has anybody heard? Oh, wait. No. Oh, I'm sorry. I accidentally deleted your message. Can you retype it? My bad. Uh, okay, so she asked whether or not we know about the promotion. Which Scott probably knows. Scott, are you here? Um, you use... PayPal at checkout, I'm assuming the app, you get extra money back at CVS. Is there a promotion there for you or for us in general? Hi, MT. Emma, exactly. No more sodas. Yes, I have seen it, but didn't do it. Jay says she has seen it. Yes, Couponing with Store did a deal with PayPal. Okay, I'm sorry. I deleted your comment by accident. If you want to retype it, that'd be great. But, um... McCall say that Couponing with Store did a transaction with the PayPal. So go and watch her video because I'm pretty sure she walked through everything step by step. Um, store is very detailed and will give you all the information. But my bad, I I, I deleted the. Let me see if I can go back and add it. Let me see. Um, my bad, I deleted it on an accident. I don't I don't know if it. If because I deleted it, if it blocked you, because now I don't see you at all. If you did chat again or type something else, I'm sorry, my bad. Um, Y'all know technology is, is not what I do. But Couponing with Store did a deal utilizing the PayPal option at CVS, so go and check her out um, to see what it's about. Cassandra, hey coach, so I did the Gillette clinical deal. I saw your video with um, you not getting the rich reward offer. You purchased two of the Cool Wave and you did get it. Was that today, Cassandra? Because I seen that Jody put up a haul video earlier today saying that she did the exact same ones that she did on Sunday. Um, and she did not get her register reward. Yes, Couponing with Store is on YouTube. That's her actual YouTube name, Couponing with Store. Go over, check her out, subscribe. You will not be disappointed. Store is about the business and she be giving it real, real. So, and then follow her on all her other social medias as well. Sorry, hon. Okay, good. You're still here. I didn't know if it blocked you or something because, you know, I'm not too, too bright when it comes to this uh, YouTube stuff with these. This technology. Oh, I'm racing water on myself. Anyways, couponing with store. Cassandra, about three hours ago, it worked for you? Well, I be darn. Jody did a video today saying it didn't work for her. I don't know when she did, like when she did the transaction, if she did the transaction. If she did it actually today, or if she had did it maybe yesterday and her video just went out today, I don't know. Um, but I did catch part of that video when I seen it, she put it up earlier. She said she didn't get the reward today. By the way, y'all, you remember these here? These were on clearance at the Walgreens a little while back, way back when, for like a buck fifty. They finally coming in handy. It's 32 ounces of liquid. So four of these, I believe, four of these equals one gallon of water. So yeah, there it is. Um, MT did it today. And it did not work for her. So, I don't know. It seems like that Catalina deal with the Gillettes are a hit and miss. Okay, so let's quickly recap. Again, I don't think there's a lot going on this week. And there's not a whole lot going on next week. The only registered award deals that I can think of for this week is the, um, the Tide and Bounty deal. On sale for $4.99. On promotion when you buy four participating products, you get a $6 registered award back. 
the Gillette Clinical is supposed to be giving back a $5 Catalina, but again, a number of people have reported, including myself, that is not giving back the $5. Why? I don't know. Don't know if it's a certain scent. Don't know if it's a regional thing where it may just not be working in my area, which I am in um, in Houston, so I don't, I don't know. Um, but that's like a wild card deal if it's going to work or not. The other deal that's given back a registered reward is on Select Crest Oral Care. It's the when you spend 10, you get a $5 registered reward. You can mix and match on what you're picking up based on the coupons that you have. But that's given back a $5 registered reward. Um, and nothing else that I can think of is giving back registered rewards. If you guys think of anything else, you can drop it in the, um, in the chat. Um... Which ones I purchased? Hold on. Okay, with the Gillette deodorant um, clinical strength, I tried, well, here we go. I got two of these, this kind right here. I got these. And then the other different one I picked up was these. Neither one produced a $5 reward for me. Don't know why. So I had did like these two of the transaction together. No reward. And then I did these two and no reward. So that was a whatever, a bummer. Okay, so to recap, this week to get ready for next week. Next week we are um, we're going to have digital spin boosters if you receive one, of course. We're also going to have one big spin deal, which is on Unilever products. I didn't even check to see if we're going to be getting a Unilever insert. Hopefully we do. I need to check that because I haven't checked to see what coupons are coming out on Sunday. Um, oh, okay. Anyways, the two things I need to tell you. So again, TMI, I'm drinking a lot of water. So if I say, excuse me, I got to go potty. Second thing is I wasn't going to do this video as a live. I was going to do it as a pre-recorded video. However... She looked at the calendar today and she realized that, oh, tomorrow is the husband's birthday. So, y'all remember a couple weeks back I told y'all that he'd been trying to get me to hang out with him and go over to the Nike uh, factory, which I am not about shopping. It's just not what I do. Not shopping for clothes and stuff. Couponing, yes. Shopping, no. And we ended up not going because um, the little girl that I keep in the morning before school, she got sick and her dad was at work, so we kept her, blah, blah, blah. We didn't go, and I was, like, so excited because I didn't have to go to the Nike factory. Well, his birthday tomorrow, and he looked at me with them sad eyes, like, well, tomorrow can we go to the Nike factory because he still got these gift cards that he just got to use for whatever reason. And I'm looking at him like, um, um... I guess. He was like, well, then we can go for brunch. And I started thinking, like, why do you want to do all these things? Looked at the calendar and realized, yeah, tomorrow is my baby daddy birthday. So, this video was going to be pre-recorded, but that ain't happened because I got a thousand things I got to take care of tonight in order to be able to hang out with him for a couple hours tomorrow because I still got deals I got to get. Like, I told him, look. You could come with me to Walgreens and get these deals tomorrow, or I can drop you home afterwards while I go get these deals. But I still got things to do tomorrow. So, anyways, um, that'll be that. So that that's what I used to tell you guys. So I don't know what my life is going to going to happen tomorrow because I have plans to do um to record tomorrow two videos, but that might not happen now that I I gotta hang out with my husband. So. Moving on. Um, okay, so next week we're going to have a big spin deal on Unilever products. And you guys say that, yes, we are getting a uh, Unilever insight. Yay for that. So select products are going to be spin 30, and you get $10 back in Walgreens cash. Well, we need high-value register rewards along with whatever coupons we get in the insert to help lower our cash out of pocket. I'm looking through the ad to try to see what all is included. Okay, we're gonna have Axe body wash it looks like. It just says Axe, okay, hair care, bath care, um, and personal care. Deodorant, degree deodorant, Dove, 
deodorant and body wash, men and women. Tresemme, Suave, those Dollar Shave um, razors. Oh, and Caress. Y'all, I haven't, I haven't purchased Caress in decades. Like, I've got a good little stockpile of it because that's my stuff. But I haven't purchased it in a long period of time because we don't always get deals on it. Now, back in the day, I used to always get deals at the Target on um, Caress. But y'all know I don't shop really nowhere else. So, I don't have time for that to be going nowhere else. But anyways, Caress is going to be included. You're hooked on Mr. B. Allen, y'all. It is so addictive. It's not even funny. I absolutely love his storytelling. I, I know, look, I literally, I believe I have watched every single episode that he has posted so far. So now I'm like all the other million people waiting on him to produce new videos. And I'm like, dude, come on. I know you got a life. You got a family. You got work, whatever. But I don't care about that. Give me another story. Like, I'm so addicted. I be... And his channel just hoping that he posted something. I don't care what it's about. I just need to watch something. Yes. So addicted to him. I love Caress. Caress, the bore soap and the body wash. I absolutely love, 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 love. The original Silky, what is it? Silky Touch or Silky Smooth, the pink one, the original one. That's one of my favorite scents. So anyways. Caress is going to be part of that deal next week. So, we need high value register rewards to be able to do that spin deal next week. And again, it's spin 30, get $10 back, okay? So, we're going to, this week, if you have not already done so, go and grab the Tide and Bounty deal. Mix and match however you see fit. However, don't buy... Don't get the Tide Febreze, the purple one. Don't get the Febreze, the green one. When it comes to the liquid, stick with the original. Stick with the um, the Downy, the pink bottle. And I think the one that says OxyClean or something like that, stick with that one with the liquid. And then on the pods, it seemed not to matter which you get on the pods. But for whatever reason, the other scents, the, the purple bottle and the green bottle, Febreze on the um, Tide liquid is not uh, producing the register reward. It's always an issue with that. And I'm so, I don't even use Tide. Let's just talk about that. I don't. But I'm still so sick of only being able to pick up the original and the, um, the pink one, the downy. Because it's like, come on, I want to get other scents. But it is what it is. Um, Couponny Boy says, I'm not in the chat so much because I'm working on schoolwork assignment, but listening. Go do your schoolwork and come back and listen. The live will be here for replay. Go get your schoolwork done, honey. I've been disappointed in the deals that wax last week and this week and next. Yeah, it's not a whole lot going on. They're very much starting off slow with um the deals this month. I'm new, but I have a, boost, a booster of spend 35, get 8. And... One lonely four dollar register reward. Yes, You're I am live. I told you that earlier. You don't listen to nothing I say. You said recording. No, I said I was going to be live. I said text your daddy and tell him I'm gonna be live so that he don't call me. What do you need? That actually chose Taco Bell. Well, that, oh, Taco Bell. Mm -mm. No, because he said. Y'all, I'm trying to get. No, okay, let's stop. Let's stop. Pause for a second. I said it once, more than once. I'm trying to get my sexy back. Why my husband today called me talking about you want something from McDonald's? I hung up on him. I clicked. And now, what happened? Hey, Dahlia. I don't think she's here. She probably, no, she should be. She's probably at CVS. But, um, Daddy said what, uh, what we did for dinner. I said probably go through his mom cook. And then he said, nope. And then, and then, he was like, what do you I want? I was going to do spaghetti squash. He said, what do you want? Do y'all hear my daughter? My husband talking about, go ask your mama what she want from Taco Bell. I done told this man, I'm cleansing the temple this week and I'm getting my sexy back. And here he is. Talking about what I want from Taco Bell. He's not right. Um, just like you and that He look like me? You my child. Is he on the phone? Mm -mm. You said text him? I don't know. And then I said you recorded and then he said, I guess you're not going to eat at something like that. Ooh, no, he didn't. I guess we you ain't know, you know what? Um, what's good at Taco Bell that's keto fr friendly, y'all? Oh, Miss Karen. Miss Karen, Maddie said you try not to cuss. No, that's just how Miss Karen type. 
She said she, she a type of word to do dot 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 and then finish her sentence. Um I don't know what's at Taco Bell that's gonna be keto friendly. Thank you. Say thank you, Mark. Thank you for what? And then wait, both of us or just Oh, me? do um do all y'all have long curly hair in your family? Yes we do, Jason. But boom, but boom. Look at her showing her inches. That my, that's my youngest daughter. That's my youngest daughter. Okay, I forgot this. A power bowl. Okay, wait, wait, hold on. Sharana, what comes on a power bowl? Because I can't be eating everything. Okay, tell daddy to give me a power bowl with beef. Because it comes with beef, right? Tell him with beef. Um, No tomatoes. I don't want no tomatoes. Just going to make me smile. Girl, bye. Are you listening? Yes. A, no pow a power bowl with beef. No, no tomatoes. Beef. No sour cream. All everything right. else I'll take. Yes, ma'am. Thank you. I forgot to make you a good uh huh. That's my um my youngest daughter. Oh well, steak. Okay, I told him beef, so that'll work. Um, my oldest daughter, Jason. You want to see her? She's not here. She had um, she's on the dance team at the high school, and they got a game tonight, so she's at the game. But anyway, she has. I mean, her hair is probably past her butt when it's straight and and it's thick and curly and gorgeous and all the above. I'm going to do that power bowl. That's what I told her to tell him to get me. And we'll see. I'll probably eat half of it because I'm really not that hungry. Okay, so if you haven't done the Tide deal, please go and do the Tide deal this week, okay? Um, get that $6 register reward. You, If you don't have the Tide coupons and you're not able to print them from the PNG website, if you have any manufactured register rewards from any other deal that's not the Tide deal, Use that extra coupon to keep the cash out of pocket as low as possible, okay? If you are, um, okay, if you can't do the tie deal for whatever reason or you don't want to do the tie deal, I have another deal for you with getting a register reward. We'll get to that in a second. But anyways, um, we need those high value register rewards for next week, okay? All right, another deal. To grab this week is on the dial body wash so this is a month long promotion at walgreens they're on sale for buy one get one half off on promotion for when you buy two you get two dollars back in walgreens cash not a whole lot they're quite expensive like 550 a piece like why but they are however we do have i bought a rebate for a dollar 50 back up to five times so with the i bought a rebate it makes it a pretty sweet deal now, what I did, because I got money to roll, you know, I'm over here rich, rich, you know, Walgreens rich, is I picked up six of the Dial Body Wash um, in one transaction. I used one, uh, what was it, a dollar off two insert coupon, and then I used a manufactured register reward, and then just rolled Walgreens cash, and then submitted to Ibotta for $7.50 back, because again, it's $1.50 back on, um, I don't know who this is calling me. A dollar fifty back on Ibotta up to five times. So grab this. The Ibotta rebate shows that it's going to expire soon. Hopefully it resets since this is a month long deal at the Walgreens. So that would be perfect to keep doing it over and over again with the um the Ibotta. Lily, what is noon since January and I lost 15 pounds slow and steady wins the race. They have a deal for a year's membership is 70. What is what is noon? What is that, Lily? Sheila, your youngest daughter name is Maddie too? Oh, how funny. Is she a hot mess like my Maddie? Because my Maddie is a hot mess. She's my um she, yeah, Jay, we both are. I'm going to say, yeah, she is definitely my mini-me. She is my mini-me. Okay, so I don't think I'm caught up. Um, I'm behind on the chat for some reason over here, but, you know, it is what it is. Let me go down. Okay, so, again, we need high-value register rewards for next week. Next hot deal in my opinion, Kellogg cereal. They're on sale for a dollar and eighty-eight cent this week. We have a digital coupon for a dollar off two. We also have an insert coupon for a dollar off two. Not sure if we have any other insert coupons. We may or may not. Um, I'm sure we have printable coupons on coupons.com as well. 
But of course, with Walgreens, manufacture register rewards and or Walgreens cash um, to pay for this. Now, this deal comes around maybe twice a month between the Kellogg's being at 188 and then the General Mills being at 199 or 188 as well. I never, 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 never pass up the opportunity to stock up on cereal. My kids legit feel like they can they cannot live their life if they don't eat cereal at least once a day. It's a whole situation around here. I'm talking they will eat this breakfast, lunch, dinner, snack, and any other time in between. They love them some um some cereal. So I never pass up an opportunity for getting cereal. <laughs> Sheila, you said she's the worst. Yeah, that's my girl. She's the worst. Um, okay, so um clearance fine. This here is a elbow strap. My husband said get this because it's what he needed. So this is three dollars and forty nine cents unmarked clearance. Okay, so one of my stores were not tagged at all. The other store was tagged, but it was only tagged for I think like maybe 40 or 50% off. However, they're actually 90% off. So I think the original price for these are like $24 or something like that. I don't have a receipt. Anyways, I think they're like $24 or something like that or $30 something, I don't know. But they're 90% off, so it rung up for $3.49. Now, there's other items also included. This is an elbow strap. Hopefully, you guys can see that. But they also have the ankle, um, like the ankle support that, that goes around your ankle that is also on um, clearance, unmarked clearance. And here's the barcode. And they're different sizes. So this here is a small medium. I did see some tags for the medium no, the large and extra large. My store didn't have any because um, somebody obviously beat me to the punch. But nonetheless, $3.49 if you're in need of this item. Again, here's the board code. And it's just one of those random clearance finds at 90% off. The store was tagged for quite a few different things. So always take a moment if you have the time just to kind of scroll through the aisle to see what's um, with the orange tags. And ask for a price check because the tag most likely is not correct. It may be lesser than what the tag say. So always ask for a price check. Okay. Uh, Cassandra says, Coach, how much fiber do you consume? It's a great weight reducer. I do two um, tablespoons of flaxseed, two tablespoons of chia seeds, one tablespoon of oatmeal the night before with hot water. I blend it the next morning. Um, Blend it with the next morning. Yes. You said Super Bowl? A Supreme Bowl or something like that? You can't look at your comments today? No, it's called a Supreme Bowl. Oh, a Supreme Bowl. With the steak, babe. Oh, you're, you're not like the Super Bowl. She said the Super Bowl. You said the Super Bowl. I forgot. Because you wasn't paying attention. I did. Okay, I'm on live. So give me that with the steak. No tomatoes and no sour cream, please. I ain't gonna remember all that. Text that to him. Bye. I can finish. Supreme Bowl? Okay. Yeah, Supreme Bowl. No no tomatoes, no sour cream. Supreme Bowl. You got one job, Maddie. Supreme Bowl. <laughs> oh, it's called a Power Bowl, not a Supreme Bowl. <laughs> I'm sitting there fussing at her. She yells back, Mama, you got one job. Because I just told her that. A Power Bowl, my bad. Yeah, I know what it is around here. It's a hot mess. Anyways, um... Fiber, I do chia seeds. I don't do flax seed. Maybe I should start adding that in. I don't do oatmeal because I cannot stand the texture. It is not my cup of tea. But I do chia seeds. And I'll put chia seeds in like my water. I cook with chia seeds with different um, things. Um, but maybe I can add flax seeds too. But I do do chia seeds. Um, Noom helps you track your weight using psychiatry. 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 Why can't I say that? Whatever. Okay, Lily, I'm going to look into it. I never heard of that. Does it tell me you don't need these cookies? Does it tell you that you don't need these cookies? Um, Safeway has been on fire with deals lately, with cereal deals. I don't have a Safeway since here, but isn't that a Kroger store, right? Safeway is Kroger. Um... Milk or yogurt, and it's awesome. I use honey for the sweetener. Cassandra, okay. I don't do oatmeal, though. I would have to find something else. It's the texture for me. I can't do the texture. 
Any idea where Walgreens will go 90% on summer items and school supplies, or did I miss it this year? You didn't miss it. Typically, it's the... Uh, well, Labor Day just happened, so it may it, it may be next week. It may be coming. But then again, everything's just been so off. Or it may be that, that week after. It's usually in September, though. It usually is. I haven't even noticed anything being tagged for back-to-school stuff. Sheila, she's only four and she's a hot mess. Well, I, you see my daughter. So that's what you got to be um, looking looking uh, forward to because my daughter is a mess. Uh, see Marie at um, Taco Bell. So I'm trying to get my sexy on and the hubby is still trying to feed me all this fast food. He texts talking about what, um, what I want from Taco Bell, asking everybody what they want. And I'm like, dude, I'm trying to eat clean here. So... I'm like, okay, what's keto friendly? And I'll do the, the power bowl. My daughter called it a super bowl, and I call it a supreme bowl. So we both a hot mess. Yes, flax seeds in smoothies. That would work. I do chia seeds in smoothies, but I haven't added flax seeds. Um... Oh, Lily says that app noon helps you understand why you eat why and what you eat oh gotcha so basically it's going to tell me i'm addicted to oreos and i can't uh unsee them once i see them are you going to try the, to do the gillette deal nope i'm over it i done tried it twice so many people are saying they didn't get it the register reward so i'm over it safe rate is the same as aberson's okay i have an average no do we have Appersons here? We have Randall's here. Safeway is Randall's too, right? Safeway is Randall's, I believe. We have Randall's. I have a Randall's. Yeah, I can do I can do deals at Randall's. But I don't go there often. They're expensive. But they do. I know they do be having good deals. And when the deals are there and I see them posted like all over the um, Instagram, I'll hop my little tail over there and, and snag them up. But I don't really be... Um, I don't really be looking at the ad. In fact, I think the ad comes in. I probably just throw it in the trash. Because Kroger is my store of choice when it comes to groceries. And then Walmart with Ibotta rebates and stuff. Okay, so it's um, Safeway is a Vaughn's company, which is Albertsons and Randall's, right? Okay. Um, Cynthia, seeing your interaction with your family makes me excited to have a family one day. Aww. You did the Gillette deal twice and no register reward? No, I didn't do any coin um, this year. Yeah, Sheila, I don't know what's up with that deal. I'm over it. Um, Cassandra, I did corn last year, and I'm not going to even lie to y'all. The way I planted it, I used a 27-gallon tote container, and I did, like, I don't know. I probably had, like, 12 stalks in that one container. They did fine. They produced. However, the species of bugs that corn brings into the environment are the creepiest things I have ever seen. And I was too scared. Okay, understand, I had the container and it was butted up against the um, fence, which, you know, aesthetically, it was pretty. It looked real nice and all this other stuff, but functional, and it functioned because I couldn't really get to the corn that was in the back, right? And again, I was too scary to put my hand all the way through the corn that's in the front to get to the core in the back. So what had happened was, I failed miserably with the corn last year. All the stalks that were in the front and on the side, oh, we produce and we harvest. But everything that was in the back, I let the bugs have it, the rats have it, whoever go get it, y'all get it. Because I'm not going back there to get that corn. It was like, it was, so I know better now not to put them in such a large container. And if I put them in a large container, have it to where I can move around the container without anything in the way. Again, I had it butted up against the fence. So that caused all kinds of issues. And I'm scary as all outdoors, so I was not about to put my hand in there. Try to, no, 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 no. So, that was a fail. But this year, we didn't do any corn. Um, Sheila, I don't like bugs either. Hi, Dahlia. Dahlia, you missed Madison. She thought she was already on. So, the first thing she does when she come pop her head in is say, hi, Dahlia.
Cassandra, I'm not about that life. Okay. So, here's a deal on some ridiculously expensive toothpaste. But it is a deal. So, if you have the coupons, you have the Walgreens cash, and or register rewards, um, it's a deal to do to roll one type of store money into another type of store money that we can hold for next week's deals. That's all we do all day, every day at the Walgreens. And in the middle of all that, we're getting actual product. Yeah, more toothpaste. But somebody somewhere are going to buy that toothpaste or going to be appreciative if you um, donate it. So I'm going to tell you, I'm going to tell you what I did. And I'm going to also tell you how you can do this deal. So these Burt Bees um, toothpaste, they're on sale for $4.99. They are part of a promotion for when you buy three participating products, you get a $5 register reward back. Okay, so we have a insert coupon from the PNG for $5 off of two. Say what? That is such an awesome high value coupon on some toothpaste, okay? So what I did, well, what you can do is you can buy just two, but you're going to need to add in a third item, part of the promotion. Again, the promotion is when you buy three participating products, you get the $5 register reward. There are other items included in the promotion. I did not look at to see what was all included. I just picked these up because I was like, oh, okay, this works for me. Anyways, based on what else you pick up, will determine your final out-of-pocket and what coupons you have for the third item and so on. So $4.99 each, okay? That's $9.96, right? Yes. And then minus the five off two coupons. So that brings it down to $4.99, right? Right. And again, based on whatever other item you put into the transaction for the three to get the five out of Catalina, will determine what the final cost comes out to. Nonetheless, what I did, I picked up four of these, and if anybody still has a spin booster that they're um, wanting to use for this week, digital or paper, I picked up four of these. And if you still have any of your Crest digital or paper coupons, and if you have any of your digital Colgate coupons, you can do the exact same transaction I did here. I picked up four of the Colgate toothpaste on sale for $3.99 or promotion for when you buy two, you get $4 back in Walgreens cash. I picked up four of these, okay? So getting $8 back in Walgreens cash. I had one account left with a digital coupon of $4 off of two and a digital coupon for $5 off of two, okay? And then I picked up Three of the Crest products or a promotion from when you buy three participating products, you get $5 back in Walgreens cash, and the Crest is on sale for $3 each. I used my digital coupon for three off two and a digital coupon for $2 off one. Again, based on whatever coupons you have, um, will determine your, you know, your cost. Hi, Saving with Christina. Saving with Christina is here, y'all. Tell her hello. You just got done working? Were you working on a video or were you like working, working, Christina? This deal here I'm talking about, Christina, you may be interested in. So let me quickly recap for you. The Burt's Beads toothpaste is part of a promotion when you buy um, three participating products, you get a $5 register reward back. A few different products are also included. And we have that five off two insert coupon from the PNG. So what I did again is I picked up four of these. Why is this all backwards? There we go. I picked up four of these here. I used two of the five off two insert coupons. I paired it with three of the Crest products using the three off two digital and two off one digital. And then the Colgate using the five off two and the four off two. So all of that together, once all the coupons were applied, my total came to $20.92. And of course, all of this is, yeah, I know it is a, a trip with this uh, receipt. All of these items are buy deals, so you can freely use Walgreens cash to pay. 
and get the Walgreens cash back. But even if, can y'all see that somewhere? Even if you, I'm not zooming. I done told you we couldn't figure that out. Last time I zoomed, I showed y'all all of my, uh, <laughs> my, my neck, <laughs> my neck fuzz. We not zooming, Dahlia. She's talking about zoom. I'm not zooming. Anyways, all y'all need to see is the total, okay? Because y'all, y'all get it. I can't even see. Can y'all see that? Oh, there we go. 2092 subtotal. I used 20 in wax cash. I got back 13 in wax cash. 13 in wax cash. And the $5 register reward for buying three of the Burt's Beats. Again, this is a great transaction if you're working with a booster, whether digital or spin, um, digital or um, paper. The amount we have in coupons here is, we have $24 in coupons. So here's the thing. If you have a digital spin booster for spend $20 and get $5 back in Walgreens cash, your coupons just pay to $20 because our coupons are $24 in coupons for what I use, okay? So your coupons pay to spend amount. So you are good to go with using 20 in Walgreens cash. And you will still get back the $5 in Walgreens cash for the um, the spin booster, plus your Walgreens cash for the items you purchase, plus your $5 register reward. The Burt's Bees coupon board, we have that five off two insert coupon from the PNG. And these are $4.99 each. So when you buy three participating products, you get back a $5 register reward. I picked up four products total in my transaction. I didn't look because I was being lazy. I didn't look to see what other items are included in the buy three, get a $5 reward. But anyways, I just picked these up. So there are other products included. Um, just make sure you be careful and that you're actually reading the tags because we have one promotion for select um, oral care that's I believe spin 10 get a five dollar register reward and then we have buy three get a get five dollars in walgreens cash and now we have this which is spin well not spin which is buy three and get five dollars back okay yes y'all tell dahlia hello my friend dahlia is in the chat okay yeah i'm looking at my receipt to make sure so our coupons equal $24, which covers a spend requirement of 20, okay? So spend 20, get $5 back. Coupons with just this transaction covered it. Now, if your spend booster is spend 25, you're a dollar away from spending 25. And because we know that tax will cut in to what your coupons paid, I would add something else in as a filler, just that way you're actually paying that dollar more if that makes sense whether you're paying it with a coupon or cash and you know what would be the best item to add into this here would be um the poise they're $5.99 two dollar ibc coupon which is the store coupon and then the three dollar uh, manufacturer coupon then that would give you um 27 dollars and money's paid so that would work too uh, I'm glad to hear that you're a scary girl and it gives me hope that I can do it. Jay, you can do it. I am scary as all outdoors. You can do it. Vanessa, you just got a digital booster for spend 55, get 12. Vanessa, that's not valid until next week. The booster literally tells you sneak peek, which always means it's not going to be valid until the upcoming week. Look at the dates on the booster. That way you know. Jason says that the Choco toothpaste sells well for him. I'm going to, I plan to get out and do this deal a few more times. They even have the, the Mountain Mint. That's what I picked up too. Um, I plan to get out tomorrow and do this deal a few more times to grab more of the $5 register rewards to have for next week. Again, all I'm doing here is rolling one type of Walgreens cash into 
another. Even if you only picked up four of these here in a transaction, that's $19.96 minus your two $5 off two insert coupons that takes off $10. Your total is $9.96. Depending on how you're taxed, I'm not taxed on oral care. So I would add in a filler item, a cheap candy, maybe the Reese's that are two for two with the dollar off two insert, uh, not insert, dollar off two IBC coupon or an 88 cent candy or whatever, the damn caramels. Y'all know I hate them caramels. Add in something cheap, or even go look at the clearance aisle, something cheap. That way you're at 10 and you can use 10 in Walgreens cash. So just picking up 40s in one transaction with a small filler, depending on how you're taxed, using your coupons, you would be at $10 subtotal. Use 10 in Walgreens cash and get back the $5 register reward. Yeah, Christina, I didn't notice the deal until today when I was in the... Um, the oral care aisle looking for some dang old toothbrushes because i'm so sick of picking up all this toothpaste and my store of course is all of all the three dollar um all the three dollar toothbrushes you can't see what michelle you can't see me or you can't see the product i'm talking about can y'all see that it's the burt feeds is that what you're talking about michelle the booster says nine eight to nine eighteen are you sure, Vanessa? Because 9 8 was yesterday. What what kind of booster? Is it like one of those boosters that say spend X X amount of times and you get X back? Or is it an actual weekly booster? Spend 55, get $12 back. If anybody can go into your app and see what the new um digital spin boosters what the dates are on them for next week because if it says eight through 18 when is the eight the eight was yesterday dahlia says her says nine it's a get 12 on 55 so you got to spend 55 to get 12 dollars back right dahlia and your booster is dated for september the 9th through what I can't pull it. Oh, I can pull it up on a computer. Hold on. Um, Carrie said I had a spin 35 get seven. My total was 39. She said I couldn't use the booster because I had 15 in coupons. I need to go rewatch your um, videos on booster. Um, you sent me a pic, girl. I can't. Okay, I'll have to. Let me go get the other phone. Um, Carrie, it's just your cashier not knowing nothing. That that's. That's that's what it is. Um, Carrie, question. Did you scan the booster before you gave her any paper coupons? Did you scan the booster first or did you scan it last? Marie says her says 912 through 918, which would be right. That'll be the new sales week starting on Sunday until Saturday. Dahlia, once you clip it, go in. Go back in the app and look, because maybe it's just because you clip it today on the night that it's showing there. But anyways, all that to be said, Vanessa, that booster is nine times out of ten. Or I should say ten times out of ten, because I'm pretty sure. That booster is not going to be valid until Sunday, which is the start of the new sales week. You'll have Sunday until Saturday to utilize that booster, and it is a one-time use. Okay, my dear? You had her scan it first. Okay, so she can't do anything. Carrie, she can't do anything about it. Once you scan the booster, it accepts. She should put it down to the side, and then she should scan your manufacturer coupons. Now, was she a complete butt, and once she seen that your coupons brought your total down to whatever, then she was like, oh, well, you can't use this. And did she physically take it off the transaction, like go into the screen and take it off? Did she do that? Because if she did, I need her number. I need to know what store you was at. Give me her name because I got something to tell her. No. But still, did she do that? Because that's the question. That's the question. <laughs> Jay, put the receipt on neck and, and Zoom. No, ma'am. $5 walk raise cash when you spend $22. Thank you. Yeah, it's, it's the ones that's new for 
for next week. Okay, so y'all, we all got that, right? This is a, a sweet little deal to do maybe maybe three or four times. I did it once today because my store only had four products. Why? I don't know, but they only had four. I'm probably going to go, go and go. I'm probably for sure am going to go and do it three more times. That way I have $20. $20 in uh, register rewards from that. How many times do you get up at night? Your girl, Patty, the other night I had to tell my dog, I'm so sorry, but this is going to be an all-night situation. I know when I walk past your bed, because this bed's at the foot of our bed, and I'm like, I know when I walk by your bed, I'm disturbing you, boo. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry, but I'm going to be peeing all night, like all night. I'm, I mean, I had to question myself, girl, are you pregnant? And then I realized, no, fool, you just decided to drink all this water every day. And then you're not only drinking water, but you're drinking lemon water uh, or mint. I put lemon and mint in my water. Um, and then I'm drinking apple cider vinegar in the morning. And then I also drink MCT oil in my coffee. So, y'all, I've been going through it. Hey, baby. I've been going through it, y'all. I've been going through it. It's a whole thing. My poor dog be like, dang, you getting up again? He be, I know he be thinking if I'm biting her ankle, she gonna think I'm wrong. <laughs> I had to tell my baby, I was like, I'm so sorry, but it's gonna be all night, boo. All night. It's gonna take my body at least a good week or two to kind of get used to it, and I won't have to go so much. So, gonna keep it going, keep it going. Yeah, it's sneak peek. It's not gonna be available until, um, until Sunday. On the new boosters. Okay, so that was pretty much it on that. That's the only deal I did different today was this and getting that $5 register reward. So, again, my plan is to probably do this three more times. The deal, if I'm not mistaken, if I remember correctly, the tag said it expires on the 11th, which is Saturday. The coupons don't expire until the end of the month, which is the 25th. Dahlia, are you by chance in Walgreens? Or is anybody in Walgreens? Oh, thank you, Patty. Um, is anybody currently in Walgreens right now? Yeah, the tax... Well, that, it depends on how you tax. So, this here, let me see. Did it rank up as a... Um, Flexible spending account item. F F uh S A. I don't think it did. It did not. So with this here, just picking up four, nine dollars and ninety six cent after your manufactured coupons with your tax, and it kicked you over ten dollars. Now, when it comes to certain oral care here in Texas, we are not taxed on certain ones if it ranks up as the F um flexible spending account fsa but on here i don't see that it said that on this receipt so yeah just four of these by themselves after the coupon 996 with tax ten dollars you send it walk on his cash and be on your merry way those five off to um uh insight coupons are the bomb.com they are the best coupons we may have coupons like that for spin deals and such so pretty sweet don't know if the if it's going to be on some type of promotion next week as well. But I'm just trying to show y'all. So that's what I did. All those coupons. Digital coupons and then the five off two paper coupons for the Burt's Beads. 2092 was the subtitle. I used 20 in Walgreens cash and called it a day. Hi, Liz. Hi, Kalina. Dahlia, you being too lazy. Dahlia, we talked about this yesterday. Do you have all that you need? In register rewards for the week, Dahlia. Mm-mm. We talked about this. You're going to be hurting come tomorrow. Trying to get it all done. And you know you don't have time on Saturday with you being in the uh, the Dollar General from sun up to sundown. You guys are taxed on everything in Louisiana and taxed um, on a total of four coupons. That's right, Kalina. That's why I moved from Louisiana. No, that's not why. But that's one of the reasons why I ain't trying to go back. That's crazy. Here in um in Houston, we don't have those complications. September is your birthday month. Oh, happy birthday. Also, side note, I told you guys earlier that my husband's birthday is 
tomorrow. So that means I have one account for the entire month with the birthday booster. What, 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 what is this going on? So I've been doing deals on his account, or rather my account, but just his phone number, all week long. Uh, well, I say all week long, <laughs> today and yesterday, because I'm just not getting out to the store. Anyways, I do have, um, I do plan to come and do a pre-recorded video that goes into somewhat of detail. It goes into details on the birthday boosters and club and all of that. But we're not going to get into it here because that's too much information. But what I will tell you, Vanessa, what I will tell you, I got my birthday um, booster from Catalina after my first transaction on Monday. Okay. September is my birthday month too, and I did get a birthday booster. This is what I'm going to tell you. Okay, the paper birthday boosters, they work like the paper spin boosters that print from the Catalina machine where you cannot use Walgreens cash to pay, blah, blah, blah. However, we know the only way you can use Walgreens cash to pay with a paper spin booster that prints from the Catalina machine is if you go through contactless pay, okay? So, that's foundational, that's foundational. I always tell you guys, the foundation is the foundation. Contactless pay is a new feature that just rolled out within the last, I don't know, few months or whatever. Okay, moving on. In order to get that birthday perk, that print from the Catalina machine, if you get yours as a paper and not a digital, in order to activate it and get it to where you can use Walgreens cash to pay and still get it back, simply go through, what you say? contact list pay pay and store option bam bam done deal that's it so the paper version of the birthday booster it will work as a paper spin booster and it will beep and say you cannot redeem walgreens cash in this transaction if you do you don't get the walgreens cash from the booster blah 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 to get around that simply use the pay in store option contact list pay with your first scan of the birthday booster it will activate the booster the booster will then become a it will be on your account for the entire month okay but it will then act as a digital booster ba boom walgreens i tell you they are just they're the land of mysteries so many mysteries but hey your girl over here figuring out the mystery she'd be over there like a detective with a little glass looking for all the clues and figuring out how we can do this and still pay pennies on a dollar for everything. For everything. I told y'all I'm not paying for nothing. For everything. So, to recap, paper version of the birthday booster prints from the Catalina machine. It will work just like any other paper spin perk, telling you you can't use Walgreens cash to pay. However, we know if we go through contactless pay, pay in store option, we can, in fact, use Walgreens cash to pay and still get it back, blah, 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 blah. So when you go to scan it for the first time and you're trying to activate it, simply go through the pay and store option. It will activate, it will stay on your account for the entire month. Every transaction after that, you do not, you do not have to go through contactless pay. Once it's activated, it kind of sort of sort of kind of switches over to being a digital spin perk, if you will, and you just check out as normal without having to go through contactless pay bam bam there we go all right let me go back up and see if there's anything i miss we got a bunch of september birthdays woo -woo! Saving Ray Christina says she got the paper booster printed at the Catalina machine and then she got a digital um, version within a week or so um, afterwards. You know, Walgreens, they just be doing, they do what they do. Paula, you may not get the birthday booster until your actual birthday. Sometimes that happens. They don't actually release it until the, your actual birth date. It, I wish it would just be the first day of your birthday month that is bam, it's there, ready to go. You can clip it and then use it. But, you know, Walgreens be playing so much. You don't like contactless pay lists? Why is that? 
Vanessa says she just brought two candy bars for a dollar to activate it. Smart. Buy some dirt cheap to activate it. Smart, smart. I told you, Kalina. Kalina said that she finally did contactless pay with an expired booster, and it was so easy. It really is. Once you know the steps, it's just bam, bam, bam. You got a paper booster, yours not till the 25th. If you got a paper booster, go ahead and activate it now, Sharon. It will work all month long. Don't wait until your actual birthday. Activate it now. Go ahead and purchase something, scan it, and it activates it. Hi, Miss Laura, but it won't work with a paper spin booster, will it? Not in that first transaction. So whenever you scan it the first time, you can't scan two paper boosters. Scan it the first time, let's say a paper booster prints, that next transaction, use your paper booster. Now your birthday booster is a digital booster, if you will. It kind of sort of converts, if you will, into a digital booster because it's just on your account. So it will work with a paper booster at that time. But you can't do two paper boosters on the same um, at the same time. Yours is on the 23rd, so I'm going to get to use it for a month. If you have the paper perk, if it printed for you, activate it ASAP. As soon as it prints, turn around and use it and activate it. It is good for the entire month. So it doesn't matter that your birthday is the 25th, 23rd, 24th. It doesn't matter. As soon as it prints. Now, if I would have went to Walgreens probably on September the 1st and did a transaction on this account, I would have got the paper booster and I could have activated it in. I just didn't make it into Walgreens for the first time this month until yesterday, I think it was. So, yeah. Dahlia, do another transaction and see if it prints for you. Couponing board, I'll be rubbing it in. He says his birthday is November the 1st, so he will always get it on the first day. LOL. Don't be rubbing that in. That sucks if a Catalina um, booster because what if the machine never works? Yeah, it will suck if it is a Catalina booster that's printing for you and you don't get the digital. That isn't fair. You're absolutely right, Paula. And it's just one of the things with the wax. It's one of the things. Hi, Nana. Yes, you only scan the birthday booster one time. Once it's scanned, it's activated, it's on your account, and you're good to go. My birthday is not until the 25th, and I got it last weekend. Patty, you did, um, did you scan it and activate it, Patty? That's a good one, Jay. Jay says, Paula, ask to see if they have a register where the Catalina machine is working. Kalina says she hasn't gotten a birthday booster yet, nor a digital. You know, it may be, because my husband's birthday is tomorrow, which is the 10th. I shopped yesterday on the 8th, so it may be that it produced on the 8th because his birthday is coming up on the, uh, the 10th, you know, just a few days off. So, of course, Kalina, keep, um, keep trying. And that's the one account that you have to shop with. So eventually it should pop out for you. But if it doesn't pop out until that week of your birthday, I'm going to be pissed for you because that's some petty stuff. That, that would be real petty if that's what Walgreens did. Because then you would only have the end of the week to really go ham. Your birthday's the 25th, which is the last day of the um, this month's deals for Walgreens. I would be pissed if that happened. Uh, Dahlia says her birthday, her husband's birthday is on November the 1st. OMG. Hi, Julia. Julia, I know I told you I was going to go live tomorrow, but things had came up. Tomorrow's her husband's birthday, and apparently I got to hang out with him. So here we is live today on Thursday. Um, Julia, you're at work. Go see if your store has these right here. They are $4.99 on sale. On promotion for when you buy three participating products, you get a $5 register reward back. I purchased four in one transaction and I threw in the Crest and the Colgate. If you still have those coupons, you can do the same. If not, just pick up four of these. We have the insight coupon for $5 off of two in the PNG. That'll bring you down to $9.96. And then simply use 10 in Walgreens cash 
and you get the five dollar register reward for buying the three so there you go there julia see if your store has them and we're just getting um we're getting register rewards this week high value to roll in for next week's deals that's what we're doing here mm, let's see Okay, Patty said, yes, she um, she did, and she got it on her second account, too. So, do you have your birthday set up on both accounts? Girl, look at you being all fancy over there. Sharon said that Wash was good to her this week. She got her birthday booster and two paper spin boosters. I haven't gotten a spin booster in, I think, over two weeks now, which really hurts my feelings. All right, Julia, I'll talk to you later. Have a good night. No, that's what I meant. If my birthday is the 23rd, am I only am I only going to get to use it for a week? If um Kalina, if you don't get the paper spin booster like before your birthday, then once you activate it, you have until the end of the month of September to use it. It just sucks that if they're going to wait until the week of your birthday to activate it, like to give it to you. That would suck. I hope they don't do that. I hope Walgreens don't do that. I hope that the next time you do a transaction, that, that paper booster prints for you. Excuse me. Hi, Katie. Thank you. Okay, Jessica says her daughter and daughter-in-law um, birthday was on the 6th and the 8th, but neither account got the booster. How can they get it? Okay, Jessica, so again, I'm going to do a detailed video on this, and it probably is going to go up sometime next week because this week is already a wrap for me. But um, long story short, the birthday club came out years ago, like years ago. It's just one of them things that Walgreens did when they first started Balance Rewards, which was walgreens points before we started using walgreens cash so i'm talking years ago so honestly if your account was not open way back when your account is most likely not grandfathered in there is nothing you can do to opt in there's not an option on the um, online system when you sign up to say do you want to get special perks for your birthday there's no option there there's no option for you to call customer service and say hey i want to be included in this and then them just da -da -da -da. no if you didn't have an account when this program was active and first like introduced i'm sorry you're just not going to get the booster most likely because it was grandfathered in and it's just one of those things i have this many accounts three of them get the booster two of them gets the booster um, as a digital one gets the booster as a paper the other one don't get the booster at all and that's the account that i probably opened within the last two years or so it is just random Walgreens. I'm not going to lie. They are a hot mess with this and it sucks. But it's one of those things that either you're grandfathered in or you're not. It does suck. I don't know why, but it does. Um, and again, there's not an option within the app or within the dot com to look at, you know, to, to opt in. You can't call customer service and tell them opt my account in because it's no option for it. It's either you were grandfathered in or you were not so I am sorry Jessica if your accounts are not um, are not grandfathered in my birthday is on the 13th and I got the paper booster yesterday have not activated it because I was annoyed my Gillette retro reward didn't print go back and get that thing activated I've been missing everything a couple weeks life had me Sorry, I haven't seen any deals in two weeks from anyone. Oh, Nana, don't feel bad. I didn't coupon it all last week. I didn't coupon again until yesterday. And that's because I had registered rewards I had to use. Um, I did the Tide deal and Gillette in hopes for a registered reward and Womp Womp. You didn't get a registered reward for the Tide deal either, Kalina? Because, man, they should have gave you that. 
haven't checked the trash cans. They they haven't been printing. You know, I go to that one store that, that is, is a hot spot for the pharmacy. And I be in that store looking at the old people like, let me see what's in your bag. The spam boots just haven't been... Um, Haven't been printing. Yes, I have it set up in my two accounts. All right, Julia. Terry says her Gillette reward printed for her today. I think it may be a regional thing, y'all, because it didn't print for me. And I tried it twice. And like I said, Jody did a video earlier, and she said it didn't print for her today either. Fingers crossed next time it prints. I hope so. I hope so. <laughs> you ain't never lying, Patty. Dolly will try to have me uh, uh, dig it in a trash can. Go, been up, spread it out my entire do. I ain't got time for that, girl. You know it cost me too much money to get my hair did. Stop playing. I told y'all we need to get one of them little uh, trash pincher things that we can reach in and see if there's any paper boosters in there. Mine was set up way back under my maiden name, and they have never asked if my birthday is correct to make sure I get it. Y'all know Walgreens is a mess. It's just one of those random things that either your account is grandfathered in or it's not. Again, I have this many, and only three of my accounts get it. You're welcome, Jessica. I'm glad my husband and I both been there since them for a birthday. Sad for other accounts, though. Yeah, Nana, it's just one of those things that either you're grandfathered in or you're not. It's just I that not all accounts get them. I don't know what's up with that. I wish it was an option, like, within the app where it will say, do you want to sign up for, you know, like, like it was with the beauty um, enthusiast program way back when. You had to actually sign up to be a part of it, but that's not how Walgreens do things. Do they have any promotion for vaccines or for the shot? Um, last time I checked, the promotion was if you if you got a vaccine, I think you got like five dollars in Walgreens cash back then, or maybe ten dollars. The toothpaste, uh, the toothpaste, the trash pincher were a dollar at Target, and I did a short video on it. I should have gotten one. You should have gotten a couple. We know you need it. Girl, no, I still got to go and uh, water my babies. I uh, I wait till it's kind of cool when I go out. So I'll wrap black girl magic, okay, black girl magic. I either wrap my hair up or I push it up in a ponytail and then I wear a sweatband because I'm going to sweat as soon as I walk out in Houston's heat. It's so hot. And then when I come back in, I leave the band on and I wait until, like, my entire body cools down. I'm not sweating anymore. Then I'll take it off, brush my hair through, I comb it through with a wig brush, and then I'll wrap my hair up. So that way, I ain't, you know, I don't ruin my little style here. And it's the same thing I do when I work out. I push it in a ponytail and just have a little band on, and that catches the sweat. And then once I completely cool down, and I'm, you know, completely not hot anymore, then I'll take my hair down. Black girl magic, you know. Uh, let's see. Tomorrow I will go to Walgreens and try the Gillette on the other scents. And see if it prints on that. I'll let you know. Yeah, let me know if it works. I'm I'm over the Gillette. I'm not trying it no more. It didn't hurt my feelings. Um, I'm in New York, so maybe as you said, it, might be, it could be regional. Uh, Cassandra, I'm in Houston, and it didn't work for me. Um, okay, the booster gives you back five dollars in Walgreens cash when you get the shot. It was twenty five dollars about a month ago when you got the shot. Um, Dahlia said. Okay, Terry says she's in um, Ohio, not far from Jody, and she got the booster today. It's really odd. I feel like it's just a hit or miss. I don't know. Girl, I've been practicing the rap since high school. I'm a, I'm a pro at it. I'm right, right fast. I'm a pro at the rap. Got to wrap it up. Exactly. Your niece sleeps in her uh, silk cap. Girl, seriously. When we get the hair done, I'll be, be all nice and, and, and fancy. 
I got to fight with Maddie because she's such a tomboy. She's so lazy. She doesn't want to tie her hair up or do anything. I'd be like, girl, it might be cute. It may be straight, but humidity don't care. It will zip, zip, zip you right on up. You better wrap that hair. As soon as you get home, wrap it up. So I got to tell her, I fight with her every day. It's to the point now that everybody in the house will yell her name when it's close to bedtime. Maddie, have you wrapped your hair? Because it takes her forever to do so. Everybody knows the routine. Yell at Maddie. See if she wrapped her hair. At this point, I think Dork gonna start yelling at her. Root, root, root. Telling her, girl, what they ain't gonna hear it. Cause they get tired of me fussing at her. And they be taking it. Yeah, I mean, her hair be cute, cute, but girl, that sweat and humidity, mm mm. Mm mm. Um, Michelle Michelle says you she's putting together a curbside order for ten for um Colgate and Crest. She saw that it's a ten dollar minimum, but it didn't apply to her. Okay, so you know what? We didn't talk about that, and I'll briefly say this. Remember with Walgreens, um coupons count in the system as cash. So your order, your order before coupons or anything is uh, before coupons or tax or whatever let's say your order is twenty dollars okay okay you purchase twenty dollars worth of products but then your coupons bring you down to let's say five dollars for the items you're buying well technically according to this new policy for walgreens you didn't spend or you didn't hit the minimal of, of the ten dollars so one would think oh i have to add more product to get to ten in order to do a curbside deal no when I first seen this come around and I seen a little paper at my store, I was like, how is this going to even work? Because, no, I lied. I didn't see a paper. I seen something on Instagram. I was like, how is this going to even work? Because Walgreens counts coupons as cash. So if all of my coupons are applied, it at least me with a total of $1. And I use a dollar in Walgreens cash. Are they going to tell me, no, I need to add in nine more dollars worth of stuff to get back to 10? Like, it makes no sense. Like, make it make sense because it don't. So, your order went through because it just doesn't make sense. <laughs> That's the best way I can say it. It doesn't make sense because when it comes down to it, coupons count as cash. So, as long as your coupons, quote, unquote, cover your purchase of $10 or more, curbside is going to continue to go through with no problem. I am getting paper spin boosters either. I figure it was because I showed out. <laughs> no, I think paper spin boosters in general just have slowed down. I haven't seen them um, a ton at all. Yeah, these, uh, Kaleen, that's how Kayleen, is that your niece? That's how she used to be because of her eczema. Now she wishes she would have listened to us instead of dealing with uh scar yeah they, they don't listen these kids don't listen i'm always fussing at madison okay i think i'm caught up on the chat before we end any questions for me at all again what i'm doing at the end of this week is um i'm going to go ahead and use all my thai liquid and thai pot coupons that way I get the $6 register reward for next week's deals. And I'm going to do the birth beads probably three more times. That way I have $20 for four or $5 register reward. So $20 there and then whatever I have for um, the $6 rewards. Because again, the, the biggest deal that I see so far going on for next week is to spend 30 on select Unilever products, get $10 back in Walgreens cash. I plan to do that deal pretty much with all of my spin boosters on all of my accounts. So if my account got spin boosters, I'm going to be doing that deal. That's my plan. Um, see, Marie said they got me like that today with that candy, and I literally made me add items to get back to 10. Cost $8.32 for the candy was a no-no. But see, with the candy, you don't have no coupons. Am I right? See, Marie, with the candy, there's no coupons. You may have the store IBC coupons, but you don't have any manufactured coupons 
that are going to equal ten dollars paid right so then yeah the ten dollar minimum would kick you out from doing your curbside deal because technically you haven't paid ten dollars does that make sense no different than how they do these spin deals does that make sense marie i must be grandfather in i've had walkerings account for many years but just started using it to its fullest potentials when i found you on youtube i shopped i stopped heavily after they said no coupon on free item <laughs> karen said walkerings gave me a super retorted digital spin booster spend 55 get 12 what the well, it used to be spend 55, get 10. Now it's $2 more. Karen, that's a blessing. Because <laughs> it used to be spend 55, get 10, right? Now it's $12. Oh, Walgreens. I'm new to Walgreens. Is the Olay deal uh, worth it? Uh, yes. If oh, Okay, so here's the thing. I always say a deal is as good as your need for the product. If Olay is a brand of choice, what you prefer, what you like, or you just need some body wash, whatever, it's on sale, it's on promotion, giving us some money back, and we have coupons for it. It is always going to be a great deal. Plus, of course, you can use whatever fake store money you already have. So if you have $10 in Walgreens cash, you can use $10 to pay, and you'll get back your five dollars for buying three participating products including your olay and or if you have manufactured register rewards you will get um your walker you can use that to pay your manufactured register rewards and you will still get your walgreens cash back hey boo dort just walked in i guess to come back here to say girl you've been on this live for a long period of time it's time to rack rack it up we gotta go eat dinner he come back here sniffing so a deal is always as good as your need for the product. Always as good as your need. Um, Michelle, Michelle, I'm in South Indiana and the humidity is real. It doesn't help that Ohio River is like right there. Straightening your hair is, um, it's, a, it's a trip, I know. Okay, hold on, let me slow the chat down, see if I can. Oh, hi, Peggy. I haven't seen you in a while. Miss you. You say I'm excellent with couponing at Walgreens. I can never get the hang of it. Too complicated for me, but you love watching me. Oh, thank you, Peggy, for still supporting. Peggy, as I have told you plenty of times before over the years, the problem is you're listening to too many people. Miss Peggy, we talked about this before. You are listening to too many people. You got people telling you, no, you can't do this. Yes, she can do this. No, this, no, that. And that gets you all discombobulated. Stick with those that actually know what they're talking about. Walgreens is not complicated. Now, I know I say that, and I know I've been doing this for years. But even at its core, Walgreens is not complicated. You go in the store, this tag says, buy three participating products, you get $5 back in Walgreens cash. You go and look at your coupons, and you realize, oh, I have a coupon for $5 off two of these products. If I only buy two, well, if I only buy three of these products, if I only buy three, I can only use one $5 coupon because my coupon says five off two. This item won't have a coupon. However, I'm buying three, so I'm going to get back the $5 register reward. So I'm good. But I really wish I had a coupon to lower my out-of-pocket even more on this one here. So at that point, you say, oh, ding, ding, ding. I did the tie deal earlier in the week, and I got a $6 Catalina for the tie. So I'm just going to use the Tide Catalina here as my other coupon. Bam. You lower your cash out of pocket. You got the deal, the promotion, and it's a done deal. Or, as my brain would do, I would say, well, it says buy three, get a $5 register reward. My coupon is five off two products. So I'm not going to buy just three products. I want to get as much products out of the store as I can every time I go. For the least amount of paper out of pocket okay the least amount of coins so i'm gonna go ahead and slap another product on there now i got four even though the promotion is by three by three get five i don't care i'm gonna go ahead and still add in a fourth item and use two of my five off two coupons 
use the Walgreens cash to pay and or register rewards to pay and then get back a register reward. So now I paid pennies on a dollar, I got money back, and I got four things of this fancy toothpaste. Okay, it's not complicated. It's really, really not. We gotta stop listening to people that don't know what they're talking about. Most people, when they do their deals, they'll say, oh, only get, only do it. Like, like for instance, for instance, the Gillette this week, buy two and you get a, um, $5 register reward back, supposedly, right? Well, let's just say you didn't want to get no more oral care. You're over it. You're done. Whatever. Go ahead and just buy three of these, okay? Buy three. So you still want to get $5 at Walgreens cash because the promotion is buy three, get $5 back. Catalina, buy two, get $5 back. You have a four of two digital. You have a $2 off one digital. Why not take the stove for all it got to get? Stock up. That's the key to couponing. That's always the key to couponing. It's the stockpile. You want to get as much product as you possibly can so that when times are hard and you ain't got the money to be couponing or you don't have the, the time to get out there and coupon, no problem. You stop. And I done told y'all plenty of times, all this stuff in here, this is not my family's personal stockpile. This here is meant for to make that paper and, you know, whatever. Anyway, it's not complicated. I try my best to, to slow things down and talk real slow, but I do talk fast and I do be moving with these deals. So at any time y'all got questions, y'all ask. Ask. Okay? Just ask. Um, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just gotta listen to the people that know what they're talking about. I do, uh, uh, Miss Peggy. I do know how to handle it because I, I, I have studied the store, so I have max, you know, mastered the store. I have mastered the store and really understand how it works. That's that's the thing. So I can keep my my money in my pocket. It takes a little time, and a little patience, but it's possible. Oh, thank you, Terry. Terry gave us a super chat for a hot ten dollars. Thank you, Terry. So it's possible, y'all, to master um, Walgreens. It's just a matter of taking your time, slowing down. Um, oh, Karen, it was spend 50, get 10. Okay, now I see why you're like, wait, they tripping. Um. Anyways, it, it's not hard. It's just really, I always say, the foundation, understanding the foundation and understanding what stacks and when to stack and how to stack and, and all that. All right, Jessica, have a good night. Okay, guys, if I missed anything at all, like a, a, an important question, what's the video processes? Come back and um and leave it in the, the comment section, what's the video processes, and I will answer you. Uh, see Marie, oh my, I got to tell Shaka, the dog, it's Michelle's fault I didn't play with her before dark. You can't tell the days are getting shorter. Uh -uh, don't blame it on me. I know Dork came in here twice already looking at me like, what's up? Like, come on, we gotta, we gotta eat. Let's do this. All right, y'all have a beautiful and blessed night. Um... Beautiful and blessed night. I will see you guys. I don't know. I, I don't know. I doubt tomorrow. Just, I don't know. We'll, we'll see. Again, I'm going to be hanging out with the hubby tomorrow because it's his birthday. Um, so I don't know if I get a chance to do a pre-recorded video. I'm going to try my hardest because I had some, some, some big plans. I did. If not, maybe a quick live tomorrow. <laughs> Whatever that means. <laughs> Anyways, um, Saturday, I'm going to be out of pocket because I'm going out Saturday night with my sister and my friend. And I'm going to get my girl, my, my grown lady on, like my grown, grown lady on. I got a cute little sexy little jumpsuit I'm going to wear too. Again, that's why I've been peeing all week long so I can drop this water away and be real cute, cute on Saturday. So, I'm not going to be available Saturday is what I'm saying. Anyways, that being said, um, y'all have a beautiful and blessed night. Uh, and I will see you guys in the next video. I will tell him happy birthday. Thank you. Y'all have a good one. Bye and happy coupon.